aircraft to join coalition secure channels. You said you're going for Y-29? You're going from Y-29, is that what you said? Did you see I it? see it right next to me. You going from Y-29, where are you going? Yeah. I'm taking off on a uh, 47. Going where? Where to? Her like defenses. Taxiing out. Well, try to catch up. Oh, I'll wait for you. B-90 Petty Brogel to Tempest Pilot. Good luck and Godspeed with your bombing run. It'll be 100 degrees to target now. Ready to roll when you are. Rolling. It'll be a right hand departure. Rotate. Right hand departure. Y-29 Ash Tower to P-47. Keep your speed up and climb gently. That's a heavy loadout. 100 true. Climbing up. Lights off. Well, lights off too. Why 
differs from my magnetic? Which one's more accurate? The uh, um, radio compass. Transition. What's it doing when it sinks? How did they sink these things back in the day? It happens. That I'm not. I'm a real pilot too. Uh, it happens all the time when you take off because the, it's a. We call it the whiskey compass. Just because this is kind of a joke, uh, which means is that they put whiskey in there. When you get nothing else fails, you broke the compass open, drank it. Uh, so we call it the whiskey compass. Uh, the thing is, it's, it's subject to g-forces. So as your g-force of the aircraft changes, it causes the gyro to get stuck. So how does it recalibrate after it's off? The gyro still going. B78 on well, to all pilots. You know Active runways on. zero two and zero yeah, eight. Once, once the bubble is off, crossing traffic. Um, then you um, then it'll it'll settle. We call it settle. It'll settle down. Um, we have a little chart. They don't have it in the game here, but in real life, we have a little chart right next to it telling that, as like it says, 25 degrees. In reality, it's um, 29 degrees. The so difference in you are you know the difference, and you, you you put it in and say. Okay, now you're stabilized. This is the offset. Right. And, and like I said, you know, I'm looking. I'm looking at my uh, gyro compass right now, and I'm doing uh, 100, about 102, 103, and it's stable. Climbing up. I'm at 6,000 feet. I'm gonna level off. I'm deep six. I'm not gonna be able to catch you, but it's okay. We're, we're, I, I still see I'm in formation. Loose. Right to that. Probably not. Planes, there's something else up here with us. Off your right wing, back. I'm looking. I don't. I don't think it's an enemy. No, I think he joined us and climbed up. Charlene over there to our uh, to our one o'clock. Yep. Ninth Army Infantry under attack. Grid eighteen eighteen. All right, we're going to be running quite close to that, and they're off to our left. Yeah, when you fly tactical air war, especially the 47, it's not up right now, but when you fly it, you have to use your whiskey compass because the 47 doesn't have a radio compass. And it's a pain in the ass. You have to guesstimate uh, the course heading, and then when you finally settle out, you can fine tune your heading. Yeah, I see him going by. It looks like a Tempest. Cool. It is. It's a Tempest. It's a fucking mean plane, man. It's a mean plane. <laughs> One of these days I'm going to have to fly the 47. I just haven't mapped my uh, turbo yet. Well, you only need to turn it on once. It's not like you have to play around with it. You don't. You just turn Can't it I on, and leave it, it on, don't worry about it. Can I map it to the throttle so it stays with the throttle? Uh, yeah, you know, you really can if you want to. Um, 
but uh, I have mine. I just I have mine to set. Uh, the rule of thumb is, and they actually modeled it correctly, is that the uh, the the boost has to be slightly behind the throttle. If the throttle is doing 90 percent, then it has to be 89 percent. It always has to be behind. The biggest thing with the uh, seven is keeping your temperatures. That's the thing, and then it flies quite 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 stable. Does it have a water or oil rater or anything like that that I'd have to put on the lever? Yeah, it's got a boost. It's got, it's got, it's got a water rater. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's got an, it's got, I see behind it. It's got an ammonia um, nitrate, uh, I mean, an ammonia water, out, I mean, water alcohol boost. It'll pick it up. Okay, looks like you're slowing down. I'm catching up here. I'm doing 260. I'm just cruising along. Get this plane above 7,000 feet, it becomes a little actually a little pretty nice airplane to fly. You get it above 20,000 feet, and nobody's gonna play with you. All right, let's line up for target. Going to combat speed. What is the target? Burley, which is right in front of us. But what is it on the city there? On the oh, edge? It's, it's, it's in front of the city. It's in front of it and it's slightly to the north. Black is firing at us. Rolling in. And it's firing at that tempest. Alright, I'm gonna take the line of our, uh, I'm gonna take the back bunkers. Alright, uh, he got the front bunkers. I'm gonna take the back bunkers to the left side of the bridge. On target. Up and over. Any friendlies near grid 2120, Tempest flight attacking Julek defenses, request cover. Good hit. Long. I was trying to get some of the guns. I right, started my rocket attack. We want to get out of here pretty soon. I'm hit. Right with that RTB. Let's go. Black. Dodge, Something's dodge, here. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Yeah, it's yeah, a 109. Yeah, I was expecting that. Dropping ordnance. Fighting with the Tempest right now. I'm going up trying to climb up to him. Into aircraft. Yeah. Dodge. Roger that. He's coming on that Tempest. Going down. Was that the Tempest? Or was that the bad guy? Yeah, the Tempest is going down. 109 is coming up. Alright, I hit him. Is he higher than you? Yep, he is. He's rolling over.
This is B90 Petty Broken. Ask for okay, runway good 05. Good 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 Winds from the east. I never got the flak firing at me. You're hitting them good, you're hitting them good. Nice shooting, nice shooting. He's rolling to the right, I'm gonna see if I can come down behind him. That had to hurt. He turned hard on me. Don't black out. Turn me. I'm okay. Get me back on me. I hit him that time good. And he's come back around again. Oh, I see. Spitfire requesting cover near Gildan defenses. Attacking the target now. Grid 1420. E90 Petty Brogel to Tempest. Give them hell with those bombs. Your six is on your six. I'm trying to come around. Maybe in two, unless that's bullet. It's coming up on right, six. I'm, I'm coming, getting out of here. Roger, just go, just go. He's trying behind me. I'm trying to get behind him. Stay up, stay up, stay up. I just hit him again. I'm out. I'm Winchester. Get out of here. Oh, shit. Heading home 309. I'm stolen. Yeah, I couldn't get out of that. He was hurt pretty bad. Yeah, he's pretty good. We'll see if it he he limps it back. Roger. I'm RTB. I hit him, but uh, <laughs> not good enough. Yeah, thanks. You we did a good job. Uh, poor Te Tempest took the brunt of it there. Oh, Tempest would have uh, put him down. You hit him good.
Hey, we should hit Kells. That's fine. I'm RTB right now. Because uh, if we don't close down their close base, they're going to close down our close base. Oh, we don't yeah, have right a close that. base. Do we have a close base? They're all defended bases. I think they all are. But Kells is a close base for them, so we can shut it down. Oh, yeah. Aachen and er uh, Vinlo are going to come active to us a little bit later. Sweet. So let's uh, let's 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 blow the hell out of Kells. <laughs> That'll piss them off. Yeah, uh, Roger that. And as soon as I get back, I'm RTB. Oh, I got the I got the kill. Awesome. I was expecting you'd get it soon. Hey, I just showed up with an assist. All right, I'm going to start Spitfire up. Spitfire uh, attacking Gelden defenses. I think what got him was the head-on we did. Because he was just me him. And at close range, these 850s can hurt. This is Y-29 Ash. Active runway 06. Pattern is left hand. All right, let me land this damn toy. By the time you land, get restarted, get everything going, I'll have my first engine. <laughs> That's true. I think I see the airfield up ahead. Hey, if you want, uh, you can uh, go to the yellow smoke, and if you don't want your points as much as you want to get a real high pointer, you can uh, rearm and refuel and uh, fix it up. Yeah, hey, uh, I know how to do that. That's. Actually, I want to change aircraft. Though I like flying the 47. Um, if I'm going with escorts, I'll fly the 47 exclusively for the whole game. But if I'm going by myself, sometimes I change that because I get tired of getting jumped. I hear you. I'm, I'm a big target. Uh, 38 is always big. Jesus, I'm sorry I'm flying back to Timbuktu. Now I can, uh, oh, connect, obviously, Mut Mutley can pilot. Yeah, Mutley and Bullet are both like top scorers. Yeah, they're bouncer pilots. I mean, that's vulture pilots to me. Nothing wrong with that, it works. <laughs> they're happy doing it. There's only one person I don't like, and I, I just have no respect for him, and that's uh, bad shit. That's that. He got caught cheating numerous times. Whatever the latest cheat is, he's got it. For a while, Alonzo had banned him. Sometimes I feel like VR is a cheat if you don't have it. That's why I put it in my name. I feel it's such an advantage to have it. It is, it is, it really it is. Field in sight. All right, setting up for uh, setting up for landing, entering downwind. Turning final three down, lock full stop.
They're active. This is why 29 Ash Tower to recently landed P-47. Damage doesn't look too bad, report to crew chief for inspection. Alright, restarted. I hear your uh, engines. Sound good, don't they? Oh yeah, Allison's. All right, let's do this again. Starting engine. This is a passionate pansy. Lovely little girl. Now, actually, before I changed my name to 103 Hill, I used to be 310 underscore Crazy Ivan. Because actually, I belonged to a 310 squadron, which was a Pacific uh, squadron. When Any friendlies near grid 2120, Tempest Flight Attack actually, and Jewish Defenses, too, and then request then they had cover. Pacific, or Starter Squadron back when 19, uh, 2005, 2006, when they came out with. Uh, Pacific. So we called ourselves the three tenth, which was a Pacific uh, Pacific uh, Theater Squadron, and was P forty sevens. You see, uh, Chuck Yeager passed away. Yeah, I saw it yesterday. He was an icon. I flew every one of his games. Me too. <laughs> and I saw him at a couple air shows. When I was a kid. I never had the honor of meeting him. Oh, I didn't meet him. I saw him fly. And Bob Hoover. And days gone by. Taxi in. It'll be a one two uh, heading, right hand departure on takeoff. Powering up. Now climbing out. Y-29 Ash to nearby aircraft. We have a fully loaded P-47 wheels up, escort if able. How much you offer you gotta put in? 
How much what? The R trim you have to put in on the 147. Not much. Yeah, but and combat altitude is going to be about 7,000 feet. Transition at 3,500. Standing by the transition. Transition to continuous climb. Tempest in grid 2120, right. we're starting our attack run on Jillage defenses. Let's say I got my throttle and my RPM not at the same position, they're about an inch off each other. And I want to slow down a little bit the formation with you here. So I pull, the, pull them both evenly. All right. Uh, yeah, you're going to want to uh, change your uh, throttle, not your RPM. So you just pulled the throttle See, the RPM in? Yeah, leave it alone, Roger. I'm climbing out at 165 miles an hour. That's the best optimum climb speed for this aircraft. And I'm doing 21, I'm doing 2,000 feet per minute. I have another 1,000 feet to pull. They're getting close to my way. I say, I see your face down there. Stop picking your nose. I'm not picking my nose. I was picking your nose. Okay, the best uh, rate of climb for the aircraft 165 miles an hour indicated. Best angle is 150. Also, the hardest on the engine. Causes it to overheat real fast. I have to look it up on the 40s on the 38s. I just got the uh, I just got the Mustangs and the 47s to, to the charts. Getting ready to level off. The, the issue with the air flying, the, uh, I know this is not the game, because people play the game, but in real life, we're leveling off. People, in real life, we fly by airspeed, we don't fly by engine settings. It's like you're early down there, doesn't it? Yep. No, that's Harleen. That's Harleen. This is the 78 Eindhoven Airfield. Active that's, runway that's 02 Harleen. and 08. Let's make a force direction to uh, one of the traffic. Harleen. I'm going to go to 130. This aircraft above 7,000 feet, I'm not doing 250, I'm actually doing 276. I have, I have a chart right next to me, it tells me the airspeeds based upon the altitude. How the hell do you look at it? Uh, lift my goggle up just a little bit. First couple times also, I, I also I know them. I know mine real well, so I know. Uh, okay, I'm doing 250 miles an hour. If that's what you want to maintain your throttle settings for your airspeed for. That puts me at about 35 manifold. Bingo. I'm 
making all my temperatures look good. The first couple times I flew on this combat box on this server, on the, the full missions, I had no idea there was such a thing as the O key. Oh. <laughs> I was so lost. I kept, because I thought maps were illegal because on the other games you can't use the map. Yeah, some of them don't want know, you using them. I didn't know the briefing act as a map, so I only had the map key mapped. How? That was a game changer. B-78 Eindhoven to nearby aircraft. We have a loaded Tempest in the climb. Escort if able. That's Hawken. All right, let's turn back to 120. Copy. Turning left, 120. Yeah, there's right below if you look off to our uh, 10 o'clock is the uh, Auckland Airfield Y46. I'm on the left now. We're going to see it down below me. It's so much fun to fly formation. Yeah, it looks good. Nice for parade. Looks good for pictures. Coming up on target area. Uh, tell me again, what are we hitting and what am I doing? <laughs> Whoops! I, I thought you wanted to go after Celts. Oh yeah, that's an airbase. Uh, what am I doing? You want me to take the uh, bunkers and buildings? I got six bombs. Yeah, I'm going to try to get the train depot, which is right next to it anyway. So. Okay. I'll try to hit uh, as many buildings as I can. We will grab attention. I'm gonna do some, I gotta do some searching here, hold on. Planes, let's move just a little to the left. A lot to the left, actually. That's his finger legs down there at 2421, so we're just uh, need to be north of those. Alright, let's look for this airfield. Should be on the other side of this woods. There's Durham, right there. There's Durham. Alright. Pick up a heading of uh, 7 six. We're hit. Break, break, break. Let me shoot, 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 shoot. 109, drop it ordinance. And he's on me. Did he get you? Nope. I'm coming in on it. Uh, he's got me pretty good. I'm totally evasive. Spitfire requesting cover near Geldern defenses. Attacking the target now. Grid 1420. Totally defensive. I got holes on my wings. I'm in real bad shape. Ooh, something else got me. Got the first guy and I'm hit. They were working together, it was two of them. It's the two best guys. 
Uh, they kicked our asses. Are you okay? Uh, I had to end up ditching. <laughs> I had to ditch too. Let me get some fresh coffee. I think it's time that we go uh, hunt bear. All right, I'm back. Okay. Okay, I'm uh, up at Eindhoven in a Tempest. Tempest Eindhoven. Figuring we'd go after one of the defenses, either the Geldern or the Gladbach. But whatever, I can switch. I didn't commit. I'm not started yet. I can go anywhere. I can go to Gildan. Two 500-pounders, Saber Boost Engine. Yep, that's what I did. And cannons to defend ourselves. Real cannons. Nice ones. I took 80% uh, fuel. That's what I took also. B-78 Eindhoven to all pilots. Active runways 02 and 08. Right, Caution, engine. possible crossing traffic. Remember, this has a water radiator lap step thing that you got to step one time. Yeah, yeah, I remember it, and it's 
Yeah, uh, mixture is fifty percent, and I remember it. I'm starting. To... I was reading about it. It's got a 14 foot prop car. Thanks, you know. Did you get that stutter there? when somebody moves. I'm gonna turn around. Copy. He said we're going to hold on. That'll be a zero eight zero heading and departure. Be a left hand departure. Oops. Going full. B-78 Eindhoven Tower to Tempest. Use all those bombs on Jerry, don't bring any home. Zero right, zero. Climb this thing up. This is the 90 Petty Brogel Airfield. Active runway 05, winds from the east. I'm in combat. Combat? Don't tell me they're attacking us already. No, combat power just to get you. Oh, wow. I didn't think I was going that fast. Tempest in grid 2120, we're starting our attack run on Julich defenses. Wish you had a mirror. You know, we were, man, this 
British pilot, we were talking the other day, and we the pictures we see of the iPhone, which is the earlier version of this, they had this mirrors. This is B-78 Eindhoven Airfield. Active runways 02 and 08. Caution, possible crossing traffic. Interesting. We're not sure where they're coming up with this no mirror. Does it have some kind of weird window shade on the front rear windows? Um, I may have not read about that. I just was reading about some of the specifications of the aircraft. But look out the front windows. It's always darker there. Yeah, that'd be a tempting. Yeah, you're right. I'm going to bring this to about 7,000 feet. that question is there flak remaining at Julek yeah yeah there is there's fast firing stuff left you don't know how happy I am with this damn problem fixed Here. I'm not sure what he's asking about enemies here. Uh, he's not sure if it's flak firing at him or enemies. Lovely enough. Defenses did we choose? Geldern. Says there's no flak at Geldern. Sweet. That's south of us. Yeah, I'm turning zero nine zero. I'm turning zero nine zero. Copy. What'd you say? Best, best what? I think this might be the best airplane in the war. Oh, I know. Everybody has their favorites, but the best all-around aircraft that destroyed the Germans was the P-51. It had the highest range. kills. Yeah, the range it killed actually the 51 killed 77 jets.
on the Tempest and the Spitfires only kill two apiece. This is the 90 Petty oh, Brogel airfield. Uh, yeah, Active yeah. runway 05, winds from the I east. I don't know if that's a comparison that matters here. I uh, hear no, not at all. Uh, and for this game, yeah, this, I love one against the other. I think this is one of the best. Now, of the Germans, well, there's a lot of good ones to choose from. I don't know. I'm. This I'm is Y29 Ash Airfield. Active runway oh, 06. Nasty. Pattern is left I like hand. Up there. Cannons are awesome. Well, I shoot them down. <laughs> I, I like the uh, uh, G14. I like the Dora. And I especially, especially like the uh, BF 110. What? Yeah, I that I the only reason I don't like about the 110, and I've I've actually got a little command to all pilots. The 1C We've about captured it. Benlo Airfield. They have ground crews are working to establish operations in real life, and their response was game playability, because the fastest the G2 could ever run on the deck with no bombs was 295 miles an hour, and that was maxed out at 180 gallons, 295. And I sent them the data from Willie Messerschmidt from Munchen. And uh, they agreed with me, but they said it was a playability issue. Because the G10, the G2s were pulled from Aft Frontline Daylight Service in 19, later last part of 1943. They were relegated to night fighter only. All right, here we are. Here's the defenses. The only thing I don't like to keep that goddamn sniper back there. Well, that guy's never He's hit good. anything. I've never hit anything with that thing. Oh. What I like about him is that he I mean, maybe me you when have. nearby. Maybe you have it, but they shoot the shit out of me. I wonder if there's a human in there when that happens, because he's never shot anything for me. It's a good warning, though. He tells me well, something's out there. That's true. All right, target's up ahead. We have bunkers to near the town, and we have bunkers to the left of the road. Inside. Aachen has now been captured. That means we have that base available. So we only got two bombs. Roger, I'm going to go ahead and hit the uh, ones closest to the canal. You can hit the ones forward. Gotcha. This is command. Is our tanks have in? captured Aachen Aerodrome. Protect our ground crews while they open the field. Say again. All right. Rolling in. Cut. This is Venlo Airfield. We've managed to open runway 09 and we have fuel, ammunition, and repair facilities. Bob's away. Tempest in grid 1420, we're starting our attack run on Gelden defenses. Destroy the bridge, that's about it. I see you down there. Like this is Aachen Airfield oh. to nearby pilots. We have German planes inbound. Yeah, there's a plane down there. The the aircraft is, and aircraft is fine. I'll come down. I got it. Good shot. Straight thing. Looks like we're gonna have to run to that. Arkin Aerodrome to you all two pilots. We're now open for business. For that, we have to there are back. some craters on the runway and some destroyed buildings. Use caution when landing. I'm going out now. Alright, let's head outbound. 
I'll be a uh, 260 heading. Correction, make that, uh, yeah, make sure, yeah, 260. Climb it. You got oil on your window? A little bit. Alright, there. 8260 outbound. Behind you. I'm going to maintain a 220 mile an hour climb. Off at 5,000 feet. Uh, in air, aircraft jargon, we don't refer to flight levels until you're above 10,000 feet. Probably not. Might be leaking a little fuel. A little on fuel? No, I might be leaking a little. Eh, not good. I see it coming out of my left wing. We're crashing on the third right now. That's not sounding good. Oh no. You need me to slow down so I can escort you? Nah, I keep making speed. If I have to ditch you here, I'll ditch you somewhere. Oh, roger that. That's uh... The rips up. That's Venray Yeah, the right rips is up right? off our... Uh, is that Venray? Yeah, that's the rips. Yep. And Derm is straight ahead. Copy. Maybe I'll go for Hell Moon. And that's the uh, Helmet, yeah, Helmet Air Base. I see it ahead. back and see if it'll be okay at a lower setting. It may be. You want me to slow down and turn with you? No, you're good. I'll do that. I'll limp. I'm right over top of uh, the moon right now. Okay. Heading to, uh, head to Eindhoven. Eindhoven's up ahead. And the airfield down here off uh, Helmut Airfield looks clear.
I love Eindhoven. Eindhoven, you're inside. Command to all pilots. We have reports of German planes near Venlo, grid 1619. Now, yeah. we'll take a couple spits out of Venlo and tangle it up. I think this has to be my last one. It's like 4 a.m. I gotta hit the... Oh my god, that's right. I forget forgetting that you were, uh, you're in the middle of the uh, yacht west. <laughs> Listen, it's nice flying with the bullet. Thank you for all your advice yesterday. Oh, and uh, everything pleasure. seems to be corrected with it. the... This is, this is a good yeah, one. Yeah, I just I got my stuff corrected. I'll probably pop the video up on YouTube if you want to look for it. Roger, we'll look for it. I usually post on the forum. I have a thing under the forum. Alright, I'll look for your uh, moniker and now follow it up. This is going for a heel, so I might descend. Copy. My window is now really black with oil. <laughs> it just hold together. You gotta have you only have a little bit of runway to go to. Funny thing is that none of the gauges look bad. Lights on. Selected radio two. Selected radio one. Yeah, these these split flaps. They were never designed for combat. They were only designed for landing or slow flight. So I get a little annoyed by the guys trying to tell me, "Oh yeah, the, the one on you know, the that's the one on the the one to the 990." Like, oh, no, they weren't. I even sent them. I even sent them a page for the manual one day. Just be off the damn band. Clearly says, "Achtung, verboten." I got you in sight there with but, the lights on. Yeah, I'm. Uh, Doing a downwind on the left hand side. I'm gonna do a straight in approach. Spitfire, this is Y46 Arkin. Three point landings are preferred. Save the fancy stuff for parade day. Alright, train left for that final. Lights on. You're down. This is B-78 Eindhoven Airfield. Active runways 02 and 08. Caution, possible Straight crossing traffic. Uh, turn it on You're base, final, three down, lock, full stop. Are you coming towards me? I think we're going the opposite way here. Okay. Roger, I see I'm it. Off. I'm gonna balk, balk, balk. You're gonna come around? We had priority. Yeah, I'm going around, that's all right. I'm down. All right, I'm going to land on the, that runway the, into the uh, Winston and Tears, parallel to yours there. I landed on runway 8 though. Turn active. See you coming in. It's still a high. You're down. Good job. Somebody just flew by here. Tempest, this is B-78 Eindhoven Tower. Do try to keep your bird in one piece. They're important for the war effort. I don't care. Yeah, we're good. Somebody just took off. You seeing that? Yep. All right. I will catch with you later. All right. Thanks for the good flights. Enjoy. Take it easy. Cheers, mate.